from the YouTube Dojo. This is Week Party with Ellie Mueller, and now a man who told NBC that the network should not let Savannah Guthrie control every single aspect of the network. Ellie Kongi Mueller. Ha! Welcome aboard. This is Week Now Update. I'm Ellie Kongi Mueller. What is up, my grasshopper? Tonight's Kelso Art Prince are A7. Oh. Yeah, LT Dogma yeah. No. LT Dogma Gaming and Tech, first of all, thank goodness I fixed that up. With the gaming and uh, things like that. A Sir this fan edits, Net Five One Nine with his uh vigilante videos and things like that. Entertainers Warehouse with this uh video his videos I don't know if he's still around. Uno Dash with his fabulous Derek McCormick show and all the other stuff. And K H Brony. With a whole bunch of uh, videos that he sometimes would slap uh, together at the last minute. By the way, he gave me a shout out yesterday. So, Egg Brony, an extra shout out goes straight to you. Alright. Now, tonight's topic is Savannah Guthrie. That's right. Now, she loves to be on TV all the time. Why? Because she never shuts up. I mean, there have been rumors of her leaving the Today Show on NBC. She shut all of them down. Of course, she done. Um, um, of course, she turned down an offer to replace Carson Daly. Don't ask, please. Hi. Now, she had kids a lot later in life. Wait a minute. Isn't she still a kid herself? I mean, she doesn't really look 47 to me. I and uh, and by the way, you know, uh, I apologize for making that joke. But hey, sometimes you know uh, you gotta you gotta make jokes. You know, uh, when you need to make jokes, and unfortunately, that was one of those times. I'm sorry. But anyway, now she had to get. Uh, now she had to get her career in check before giving birth to a girl and a boy. That was pretty smart. And again, she's basically doing two jobs. Being on TV and being a mom. I hope that she does not try to get a third one. Ooh. Well, it's time for the top eight list. Adam's out for the week. You know, so it's going to be Craigers and MP. Alright. Let's see what we got. Alright, let's see what we got. Alright, tonight's category. Top 8 shows that Savannah got the and love to host. Number 8, The Voice. Number 7, Songland. Number six, NBC Night, uh, NBC Nightly News. Number five, NBC's New Year's Eve. Number four, The Tonight Show. Number three, Dateline. Number two, Late Night. And the number one show that Savannah got to be loved to host. Last call flash, a little late flash, whatever comes on NBC at 1.30 a.m. Boys, thank you. Thank you very much. I sincerely mean that. Thank you. We'll be back with uh, Captain Schema and uh, whatever else we have flying around after these commercials. It's nice, by the way. God, I'm hungry. I just made a terrible mistake. I asked the crew when they're going to let me down from here. They told me I could come down when somebody finds a better deal than Empire's. They said when somebody comes up with a better price on good brand name carpeting, plus 72 hour delivery, plus a credit plan with 60 days to make an installment payment, plus a phone or shampoo or free with any order, when somebody comes along who can beat that, we'll let you down, they said. <laughs> 
guess I'll be up here a while. Five eight eight two three hundred and five. All you gotta say this, you know, Captain Schemer has really outdone himself this time when it comes to talking about the various uh, things. This time, I asked Captain Schemer if he could talk about Savannah Guthrie, and well, this is what he did. Check this out, alright? And this is Captain Schemer recording 16. Let's do it. I am Captain Skim. And I'm also the interviewer. Hey, Captain Skimmer, do you know who Savannah Guffrey is? Do, do you know who that is, Savannah Guffrey? Do you know? Isn't she the blonde haired woman that hosts the Today Show on NBC and tries to sneak her way into NBC's nightly news afterwards? Yeah. Yeah, wait, you have that weird look on your face. What's up, Captain Skimmer? What, what are we doing now? What, what are you thinking of now? It's going to get me angry. What is it? But what will happen if she tries to get her own late night talk show and be so... Oh, no, 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 I know. no, no, no. I know that's going to be terrible. I'm not even going to think about it. That's right. Let, let, let's just go back to week nine update. How about that? That is a fantastic idea. And you don't have to be rude to me, Captain Skimmer. Okay, I just say you don't have to be rude to me. Oh, he's so disrespectful. Anyways, let's just get back to what we have to get back to. I'm out. Well, that's actually a pretty good job. Now, according to uh, GoodHousekeeping.com, this is true. You know, uh, Savannah Guthrie, you know, uh, had to confront uh, online scam. Actually, uh. She uh, did that on Twitter, but this is true, all right? Everybody on social media claimed that uh, Savannah was leaving her job at the Today Show, or on the Today Show, I should say, to spend more time on her skincare line. Of course, uh, she said on Twitter, quote, this, this is, uh, she said, yes, this is not true. It is a scam. Now... Here's the thing, alright? Savannah doesn't even have a skincare line. Alright? You know, and all the celebrities uh, these days are dealing with, you know, all these uh, fake stories and ads. Well, except for uh, all the people who say that the Kardashians are pretty bad uh, people. That, my friends, is true news. Or actually, real news. Now, I could go on and on about that story, but let's be honest, nobody even cares about that uh, to begin with. So now, let's move on to this one, alright? It says here, it's Vanna Guthrie, now 47 years old. <laughs> You know, and apparently, uh, health.com isn't afraid of, uh, telling, uh, everybody about her age. So, I guess, you know, you know, she had this thing called, uh, in vitro fertilization. You know, in order for her to have kids. You know, and and yet she still like gets up at 4 a.m. to do the day. Now, well, you may find this crazy. You know what? It actually, isn't. You know, at least to her, because uh, Serena said, "In your 40s, and then and now my mid to late 40s." You have the difference in attitude where you can figure out what matters and what doesn't. What matters is your family. Alright. Now that's literally what she said. You know, and then she said, 
But when I think about being in my 30s and what I was doing and trying to build a career, it would have been incredibly difficult for me to have kids back then. Well, let's be honest, you know, well, when you have uh, a busy schedule, sometimes things stay and things go. I... And again, some people uh, will, will tell her, hey, you make that. But then again, that's how things get a little... You know, but at any rate, you know, Savannah is doing the, well, who really cares at this point? You know, she's supposed to be uh, some sort of a, a news anchor, right? And news anchors are supposed to stay uh, straight on the news. Now, as for me, you know, being the, uh, the late night talk show host that I am, I'll be on YouTube. Now it's my job to make fun of uh, some of the other uh, news stories that are out there. Uh, you know, right now. You know, and uh, and have a little bit of fun. You know, as long as I uh, as I don't go uh, too far. You know, and. You know, you know, I don't think that, you know, Savannah is really trying to uh, stay in, in her own lane in terms of uh, being a news anchor. Because news anchors are supposed to be uh, the ones who are reporting the news, not really, you know, being on the news. You get what I'm saying? Because if that's the case, then this would probably be every single newscast. Watch this, hold on. Good evening, everybody. This is uh, YouTube News. I am uh, Eric Mueller. With me tonight is Eric Mueller. Right, thank you, thank you, thank you. Please, please, thank you. Now, as uh, you are celebrating 10 years uh, on YouTube uh, in August, that's right. August 10, 2009 is when I started doing this show. Ten years later, I'm still here. Of course. You see? You see what I'm talking about here? You understand? <laughs> Alright. I'm glad you understand that. Okay. A lot of stuff uh, planned uh, for this week. You know, that's the show for tonight, of course. But tomorrow night we're talking about Brie Larson. You know, uh... Captain Schema, of course, will be back here uh, then. You know, I want to thank him for being on the show tonight, by the way. Uh, Captain Schema slash uh, Uno Dash. Wednesday, we're talking about Jordan Peele, another famous director. You know, it'll be on a little bit earlier and things like that. Uh, because I have uh, things to do uh, the following uh, morning and uh, things like that. You know, but uh, the show will still go on. Thursday, we're talking about Chris Hemsworth. That's right, Chris Hemsworth on uh, Thursday. And then Friday, we're talking about Chris Evans. And there'll be a new Grand Report with Babylon Creations, Michael Dyke Cat, Dev 519, Lex, and Lex, you know, the usual uh, suspects slash stars, and Uno Dash will still do uh, Captain Scheme. You know, so please tune in, will you? At the news. I'm Alski, Spiro, Viper, Wall.